Are you a superstitious person? It depends. I would say what yes. Do you mean, what do you mean it depends? I just mean, if I'm, you know, growing up, you play a sport, like you win a game, don't wash your uniform. Keep the wins in. Okay, so you, you know do that I mean? as a child. Yeah, I did that as a kid in okay. high school, yeah. Now, but, as a grown-ass adult with a child and people around you. I think the only thing that I consciously do, I put my left shoe on first. What do you mean? Put my left shoe on first. Okay. <laughs> um, are you a, a superstitious person? Nah. TJ? No, you know, because for a while, the black cat thing, right? But then I was like, I don't like the way that the black cat has been, you know, frowned upon in society. I, so my, my brother or my sister. So now I, I cross the black cat's path. You know, I don't want to. So don't you're not them. superstitious. No, I walk under a ladder. Mike, I saw Jeff Hardy walk under a ladder. I am it's extremely, fine. extremely ladder. superstitious. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh, there are things I do before shows that I'm like, Dion laying out. Clothes, it's nuts. Oh, yeah, um, like, for, this, for like, impo- like, oh, no, no, no. let me handle this. Let me handle this. Even Stop. for this show. Let me handle this. Even for oh, this show. <laughs> Stop. Let me handle this. Stop. Excuse yeah, me. My instincts just took See. over. <laughs> See, this is what I'm going for, for very important shows, right? Even this show, I do it every day. Oh, yeah, this. I oh, lay yeah? my clothes even out this show. every day. You wear it every day? You're no, I wear that different out shirts, night? but I'm prepped every every night before I go to bed. What are you prepped out? My, my shorts or my, pr- yeah, my pants are Like for sitting. colonoscopy? Yeah, you clean yourself my, out? My socks are ready. Uh, my shoes are there. Yeah, this is the biggest I lie I've ever heard. I'll take pictures and show you guys. every. You I'm prep telling you, before I go to sleep. Yes. Hey, yes. that free polo I got in 2002. <laughs> you know what? That now I understand. No, because he's prepped. Everything's settled. That's how he can start focusing on like being on his phone and doing his Instagram, banking during exactly. the show. Like banking. he's prepped. I don't do banking. One thing I do do now that I think about it is when anytime I go in an airplane, I always tap the right side no, of the I, door. No, plane. this Damn. is I'm talking about sports. Yeah, that's I was I'm talking only- about sports. And this past year for Michigan, um, I wore a Michigan sweatshirt for the game that we beat Ohio State for the third time <laughs> in a row. And I, I just decided, you know what? I'll wear it for the Big Ten championship game. And then. I'm like, do I wear it for the Rose Bowl? And I, I thought to myself, why not? Ooh. Yeah. And it was, it, it and I, as I was putting on, I'm yeah, like, yeah, I totally know works. this is totally unreasonable. Yeah. Because I also know there has to be more, way more insanely superstitious Michigan Wolverine fans sure. who are going through the same thing. And I'm like, well, if they're doing it, that might supersede my just casually putting this stuff on. But our director of today's program, John Monaco. <laughs> Prior to this show, uh, again, <laughs> Howie Barrow, the keeper of the cup, he brought the cup in 45 minutes before we went on the air. And we had a great 20 quiet minutes it with was, this cup. And I was yeah. even saying to you guys, like, I, I don't know, how, that's so rare because yeah. wherever this cup goes, it's a festival. Yep. Right? Wherever the cup goes, it's not just like in a room full of mo- most likely not seven, eight people who can just take pictures and chill out and take a close look without touching we were very respectful yes yep. okay and um because it's just like the lombardi trophy you got to put white the white uh, uh felt gloves felt, on yes. yep and in order to touch it and there's sort of certain people that can only touch it period and then there's a there's some rules about only ones who can hoist it and only those who can tip it uh and those who can drink out of it and again this is the stuff that we're going to ask howie about when he comes out here shortly so uh, it's so rare but John wouldn't take a picture with it because he's a Rangers fan. But they've won already. Dude, once. <laughs> okay. And it took forever once for the since, last. Once <laughs> since Herbert Hoover. He was yeah. alive. He probably remembers all of everything No, no, that I get it. But it's just like this entire Rangers season, which has been spectacular, as I mentioned moments ago, they are currently the points leader of the – entire league with a, a week plus to go here he won't take a picture with it i cursed him out <laughs> and i don't curse a lot to you know prior to the show or are you gonna to, get to a, a co-worker again it, it, you're right <laughs> like where you're just like and you could take a picture with it you, you could, could do anything yeah, we're I right know. here go find messier's name and just zoom in on it rich was brian so leach's name zoom it richter's name is on this cup you know, he, come on. He took his glasses off when he, he was like, so you mean to tell me <laughs> that you think? <laughs> I did say, I'm like, do you mean to tell me that you think the Rangers' fate 
in the Stanley Cup <laughs> playoffs is, is is affected by whether you take a photograph with this cup inside our studio or not. TJ, don't take a picture with Lombardi this year. Maybe Dallas will win. <laughs> that's there a you go. Point. He's got. I got a point. Don't, don't last even couple look years at I've been taking a picture don't with even it. Look yeah, at that's it. been it. That's, that's it. The only oh, reason I'm blaming <laughs> TJ. All in. That's what I'm saying. So I guess eight four four two zero four rich number to doll. Are you superstitious when it comes to your your sports teams? And if so, how crazy are you? <laughs> so he took a picture <laughs> of the cup, <laughs> it, but he wouldn't take a picture with, with the, the cup. <laughs> so I did it for him. John, we root for the Wolverines. You know, like so what? You were gonna take a pick up? You know, honestly, we probably took a picture of the ninety four Rangers. I'm sure, team, which right? is great. What a what a total pleasure it is to have the cup here. And again, I'm looking at it. You could see the dents. Yep. Oh, uh, the the top the, the top cup is all like not in a perfect circle. Yeah. It's By like... the way, Mike Hoskins, who <laughs> is the biggest hockey fan we know here. I'm sorry, Mike. I've got to do this. I've got to say it. He's a Saber fan. This may be as close to the cup as he's ever going to get. <laughs> wow. And I'm a Jet fan. I'm a Jet, and he agrees. He's going to have to agree. He's a Saber oh, fan. This is so as close bad. to the cup as he may ever get. <laughs> so and he was taking pictures with it like it was his wedding day. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Hey, hey. Look at me and my hey, friend ba- Lord. Hey, baby. Hey. <laughs> What's up, Stan? What are you doing in there? Hey. <laughs> Lord Stanley. <laughs> so... It's really cool. This is insane. Like they say it's the coolest trophy in sports. It really is. Well, it's it, listen, the Lombardi really trophy is, is cool. cool. Uh, you know, there's the, the medal's cool. No, Hunk of Metal. <laughs> the, Hunk of metal. The, the, the commissioner's trophy is cool. Right. They're all cool. Green Jacket's cool. There's yeah. only one trophy that's been around 132 years that has uh, every name of every member of yeah. every winning team on it. All right, if I put up a poll, what's the coolest it, trophy it, in sports? It's one it right has here. to be this. I've said for years, the presentation of this cup after the championship, yeah. it's the greatest thing well, in sports. Well, like when they the, show it before? The, the, uh, a, a longtime executive of the NFL who I've, I've gotten to know while he was with the NFL in charge of uh, events, the, the big events of the NFL, a guy named Frank Sapovitz came from the NHL, and he's just like, we need to start treating the Lombardi trophy yep. like we treated the cup. And he was the one who started with that presentation of having oh, the gauntlet, having the gauntlet, yeah, 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 yeah. having That's the really gauntlet, cool. having yeah. the cup, having pardon me, the the, the Lombardi being brought Throw through out. by a former winner of it, and the players are gauntleting in it and touching it. Yeah. It's, I'm getting goosebumps just yeah. even mentioning. Made a whole di- big presentation of being brought to the podium. That was so awesome when you guys started. They yeah, started. well, he, and cool. uh, that was Frank. Yeah, you know, because he came Frank, from the NHL. Frank. He's just like we got to start treating the Lombardi like a, like the cup. So hey, Frank, I haven't spoken yeah. to Frank in a while. Thank you, Frank, sweetheart of a guy. Yeah. Um, and here we go. Catch the Rich Eisen show every single day on the Roku channel, twelve to three Eastern, for free.